my person came back. He missed me. He finally missed me. And I remember he would come over and like, I just want to see you because I missed you. Hey everybody, it's Elizabeth with World's Cup of Joe. Awaken your soul, forgive me. It's super early in the morning and snowing outside and it's so cold. Um, something just came to me while I was sitting here just relaxing. It was like this that I thought would be so helpful for so many of you in this journey. When I first went through separation and my person moved out, when we started talking, sort of again, I mean, we were talking, it wasn't anything significant, but he was finally taking my calls. I guess that's the best way to say it. He was finally responding to my text messages. They were few and far between, but he was responding. And I remember him sort of pleading with me in a way, the way it came out. He said, I need to miss you. And I, I didn't know anything about this journey at that time. I was just going through the pain of the dark night without knowing what it was. And I remember him saying, I need to miss you. Like I said, in almost like a pleading way, I need to miss you. And I'm thinking, I, I'm hitting there sobbing on the phone, like, I already miss you. What are you talking about? You don't live with me anymore. You moved out. You barely text me. You barely call me. What do you need? What do you mean you need to miss me? How do you not miss me? I miss you terribly. We never speak. We never talk. I don't ever see you anymore. And now, now it's like this huge light bulb has gone off in my head with this comment that came flash, flashing back to me. He was not able to miss me despite the 3D separation because my energy was always with him. It was always pushing against him. Here I was only seeing the 3D because like I said, I, I knew nothing about this journey. And I saw the separation. I saw that he was barely talking to me, texting me, calling me, wouldn't come and visit. And all he could feel was my energy, my push energy smothering him. So when he begged me, I need to miss you, it wasn't 3D. He was actually feeling it from the energy standpoint. What I couldn't sense at that time, because all I could all I could feel was the addictive energy. He felt the same energy, but the push of it. How freaking incredible is that so this is why releasing this addictive energy is so critical in this journey releasing that push energy and focusing inward and turning that energy to yourself bringing it back in because what we see in the 3d they are not seeing, they are feeling the energy so strong as if they never left and they were being smothered. Joanne and I created the 30 day detox because it works. It helps you release your addictive energy. It helps to find balance in your life. It worked when she originally helped me and I was able to let go, surrender, find the love and the peace that I needed to feel within myself, the person came back. He missed me. He finally missed me because my energy was no longer pushing towards him. He couldn't feel that push and he was able to miss me. And I remember he would come over and like, I just want to see you because I missed you. Such a beautiful realization. I really hope this message helped because it came to me and it was like, oh my gosh, I need to share this with everybody. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Love you.